Hi Crypto Kings and Queens, we are looking at Bitcoin and right now we are just below the 50%. I do believe the market will continue back down from this level and we can come back down to the 61.8% that we're having on the weekly. We've been talking about this one million times, but on this four hour candle that just opened, we're having very huge bearish candlestick to the downside. I do believe we will continue back down and I'm having certain levels. I'm having, for example, uh, 53,000. 700 and that is the previous support if we're closing above the 50 percent i still believe the market will continue back down and fill this week that we're having right now looking at the charts we are actually on our way down we'll see what's going to happen on the higher time frames we're also having the fibonacci combined with the trend line so next week i do believe that we can bounce in between these levels on the 50 and 61 percent that we're having on the weekly chart remember i'm no financial advisor you need to look up everything yourself first please continue watching this video and i'll show you what i see right now on bitcoin if you're scrolling down to the description down below you can see that we do right now have a bonus on bybit up to four thousand one hundred dollars and bybit is a super good platform if you're a swing trader with very low fees and that means that you're holding your position for a very long time if you're new to this game obviously but otherwise you already know that scroll down to the description down below and claim this bonus that we're having right now on bybit and please guys you can already see that i like my own video but i can do it again please go inside and like this video and support this channel so we can reach out to more people we're starting off with the daily we already know what's happening on the on the weekly chart and we are right now at the fibonacci level uh 50 at 54,480, and we are just right now touching that level again so we're close we are having the daily candle going below the 50 percent i do believe that we still will come back down to 58 51,800, and that is the 68 percent 61.8 percent that we're having on the weekly fibonacci continuation to the upside but right now we need to focusing on what's going on on the lower time frames to see what actually can possibly happen looking at this right now so i had two sell limit orders right here and i'm gonna take them away because i do not believe the market will come up to that level and in the if the case is that the market is doing that i have to look at the market in a whole different way than i did before okay so going to the lower time frames we can see what's actually happening so we're going back in time we can take the other chart instead we're going to the one hour and so we're just going back to what's actually where we actually did retest okay so we're having the market so i'm just going to take a horizontal line and then i'm going back in time to see what level we did actually respect i'm gonna look at at on the lower time frames instead so i'm just gonna go back in time let's see let's see let's see um okay so we are right here now going to the lower time frames okay so we did respect this level at okay so we're having a level right here that i'm gonna use in the future um, so i'm gonna take these away right now because i don't need them i want to have a clean chart as possible so now i kind of know why we did came and uh and why the market did stop right here because that was a previous low that we did have a long time ago okay so we're focusing right here now okay so i'm having huge momentum i still believe we will continue back down and right now we are respecting this previous low that we also did have right here so we're just gonna see how the market's gonna react to this level that we're having around uh, 54,492 and if we do now see the market having the breakout retest we could see market continuation to the upside or if you see the market right now closing below continuation to the downside so we just might have the retest so this could just be the market retesting this low that we're having around 54,500 and then we just might see the market continuing back down and that could be when we're actually coming back down to 61.8 right now as i told you we are respecting respecting 50 uh, the 50 percent 
on Bitcoin. We could, and going back in time, we did retest this previous resistance, always a previous support. Market tried to fake us out from this level. You saw market come in, retest continuation to the upside. We can even go back in, in time even more. You have supports, resistance, resistance, support, support. So this is a pretty strong level. We came up and retested. Looking at this wick that we're having, okay, so we're wondering why do we have so many wicks to the upside? You have one, two, three, you have three wicks right here and the market told us, hey, we're not coming back up. So that is why we're having this huge candlestick and we can already see that the market is now just retesting this low that we did have on around, uh, and that was around New York, uh, London session. And we just might fail this week and then might see continuation to the downside. So I still believe the market on Bitcoin will continue back down. We just had a small uh, push to the upside. I do believe the market will continue. But hey, that is just one, something that we need to see. It's 500 pips down to the 61% from where we are right now. And to the trend line that we're also having is around 700 pips. So it's not that far away. This is a downtrend. So for me to start buying this market, we don't know how long the pullback is going to be. So that is sometimes why we good waiting for the impulsive move. And the impulsive move is the downtrend. So when that is selling the market, I strongly believe we will continue back down on Bitcoin. Nothing more than that. We just had a small correction to the upside, but uh, as long as we're seeing the 50% being break, so it's okay. So we did open with a new uh for our candle so that is why we had such huge momentum to the downside it's nine minutes left of this nine uh of this one hour candle if we're closing below if we're closing below 50 percent uh we can yeah that could just be the push to the downside and even if we're not doing that i do believe that we will have this wick filled this wick if we're closing if we're closing above I still believe the market will come down, come back down and, and fill, fill the wick that we're having. We can also use this low right here and market can come up, can come back down to 50, 53,700. And then you just might see the market coming up to the 50%, then continues back down and slowly starts to break into the downside one more time. But right now we are inside the Fibonacci levels that we're having on the weekly. So next week, I also believe that we will come back down. We just might start to have dojis around this level. The market just might go in sideways when we're looking at the daily or the four hour chart. So I do believe the next week we will just bounce in between the 50 and 61% and maybe even 55,900 bouncing in between before the market then decides to break to the upside so this is what i got right now on bitcoin guys i hope you're having an amazing weekend in sweden it's like dark 24 7 so i'm pretty tired all the time but if you are having a nice weather i hope you take advantage of that because i would do that hit the like button subscribe to this channel i i have multiple live streams during the week i have every single day updates about cryptocurrencies comment below if you enjoyed this video otherwise we see each other in tomorrow's live stream and in tomorrow's video have a good day from sweden Bye.